Axel Mattiason, founder and CEO of the Forever Social. Stockholm's eighth unicorn. Yeah, that rich famous asshole has been promising digital immortality. A Swedish tycoon, Carl Axel Mattiason, has been accused of a pivotal murder, fraud and theft of hundreds of millions of dollars. The murder has spelled doom for his firm, the forever of social. But as per Carl, he is not the one behind this murder. So who is the actual killer? Carl's best friend and CTO was shot at from point-blank distance, completely disfiguring her face. And her nose was stuck in the wall next to another crater created by Bullet. The police, Interpol and investors all are annoyed and Carl has been hiding in a secret location, running for his life. He needs your help. So are you ready to solve a murder mystery in the metaverse and discover the truth? Wondering how you can be a part of it? Hello and welcome to 3 Doro TV. I am Vishaka Thakur and you are watching a special show, Metaverse Magic. In every episode, we get some fascinating updates for you and this time, we are starting with a story filled with several murder mysteries and unexpected twists compelling all the players to solve one ultimate question. How has Forever fallen or who is the actual killer? Well, Forever Has Fallen is a captivating, story-driven metaverse where you as a player can take on the role of a bounty hunter to delve into thrilling mysteries. As a bounty hunter, you can immerse yourself in the riveting tale of Carl Axel Mattiason. The deal is, you will get an opportunity to engage with high-definition audio narratives and find some clues. Well, these clues hidden within fictional websites will lead you on a captivating quest. Interestingly, in this thrilling adventure, a meticulous NFT ticketing system will ensure that every solved mystery receives due acknowledgements and rewards. Well, the mystery of life is not a problem to solve, but a reality to experience. Deep, right? So let's lighten up the mood as we are now exploring a resort in the metaverse. I am talking about Blue Diamond Resorts, the fastest growing hotel brand in the Caribbean who have recently entered into Metaverse. All the travellers can now experience 360-degree virtual tours of all their properties in the Caribbean. Let me tell you that Blue Diamond Resorts encompasses over 60 properties in the most popular holiday destinations in the Caribbean. Anticipated to be available for virtual touring before the end of April 2024, this initiative demonstrates Blue Diamond Resort's commitment to innovation and leadership in providing immersive experiences for its guests wherein one can immerse themselves in carefree days and have a relaxing spa near some fascinating beaches. And now let's explore the sporty side of the metaverse. Basketball legend Lisa Leslie has joined the metaverse bandwagon as she has recently partnered with Loot Mogul, which is a multiverse blockchain gaming platform where sports enthusiasts and influencers converge. When well, Lisa is a three time Women's National Basketball Association's Most Valuable Player Award winner and a four time Olympic gold medalist. She has now joined Loot Mogul as its brand ambassador and business partner. By being a partner as well as a brand ambassador, she is pivotal in shaping the platform's vision and outreach, particularly in bridging the gap between traditional sports fanfare and the world of virtual experiences. And now let's listen in to what our special guest has to say about the metaverse sector. So if you look at Vishaka, uh, the last one year, if you look at it, the metaverse has jumped so much uh, that you know you have almost 20, 20 plus billion dollars coming up from the metaverse market. And it's all because of a lot of things which have happened. First of all, you have a huge amount of industries coming in like NVIDIA uh, has come out, Apple has come out, you have Facebook which has come out. Apart from that, you have uh, uh, Siemens and uh, Accenture, everybody is working on the platform. For, for metaverse so digital queen and other applications have become much more and more important in the next two years we are expecting around 40 billion dollars of um, a, a market for metaverse to come up and india i think will be um, um, gaining almost 10 percent of the market share in this particular uh, model i feel that's that's the uh, way to move forward 
Moving on, we have often heard about wildlife conservation, afforestation, protecting flora and fauna. But there is little or no awareness of marine mammal conservation. But now, Palako Sanctuary is taking step to raise awareness on this through Metaverse. Well, Palako Sanctuary is a cross-border sanctuary for the safeguard of marine biodiversity. On the 25th of November 1999, the Palakos Agreement was signed in Rome by France, Italy and the Principality of Monaco. The Metaverse Initiative will create an immersive, educational and fun experience for the younger generations as it will mainly focus on the importance of marine mammal conservation. And you will also have an opportunity to explore the diversity of marine life that thrives in the Belago Sanctuary as well as understand its daily challenges. And now an exciting update for you all. It is often said that a pen is the tongue of the mind. And today I am going to tell you a story about a magical pen. The Big Crystal is an inexpensive, disposable ballpoint pen which is mass produced in France. It was introduced in the year 1950 and later became one of the best selling pens in the world. Well, Big aims to empower youth through creativity and self expression, and in regard to this, the firm has been organizing several events. In order to broaden its reach, Big has launched an art gallery in Metaverse to promote innovation and creativity in Africa. Yes, by launching the Art Master Africa Metaverse Gallery, BIC aims to encourage talents to express themselves using the BIC ballpoint pen. Isn't that exciting? Well, this is an exciting opportunity for all the artists from the Southern, Eastern and West African region. And all the visitors across the globe can immerse themselves in the creative work crafted by the renowned or budding artists based in Africa. Well, that's all in this episode of Metaverse Patrick. I will be back with more such interesting updates from the Metaverse space. Do log on to our website www.3worstv.io or scan the QR code. This is me, Vishakha Thakur, signing off.